Well, hello there, all you diggy diggy dwarves. So today, we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to build upwards or how to build outside because it's come up a few times in the Facebook group and I want to be helpful. So let's get on this. First thing, we're going to need to chop down some trees. Let's set some trees for clearing and let the game run. See if we can get some dwarves on these trees and gather some wood. Little cute lungfish out there hopping around. Oh, here we go, getting our first tree chopped down. Alrighty, so we've got some wood. The first part of constructing is going to the build menu, pulling up constructions. We're going to need to do walls, and we're going to want to keep building after placement. What that'll do is it'll let us build a wall immediately after we select this wall tile. So we'll select a wall tile, select the logs, because they're quick to move, not the stone. Select a wall tile, select the logs. Select a wall tile, select the logs. And you do the corners first. This is important because when you go to build the walls in between, they won't do the corners and they won't be able to get to them. So you've got to wait until they get the corners in and then do the walls. Now, you can come back later at another time and put floors in this. But one thing you do not want to do is put a door in your entrance unless you have a floor built there already. So we'll build a floor there so we can build a door there later. Now, in order to go up, we're going to need to build a set of stairs. So we go to construction and we can either do a ramp or a stairs. We'll do a stairs. We'll do it right there in that corner and we'll go up a Z level and click and it'll allow us to go as high as we want. That should take us up to this next Z level. It'll build the stair up and then the downstair that breaks through this floor level. Now she'll finish it. There we go. Now we can start on the floor. So we'll click, right click to get out of that because we were building another staircase. We don't want that. We want to start building a floor. We have to build out there. We're going to run out of logs soon and we can build along here because what they'll do is they'll walk along this wall and construct this floor. While they're doing that, we're going to go chop down one more tree or two. Yep. Cool. Alrighty. If I had a workshop going, I'd build a door for here, but they've built the floor here. If we don't build the floor before we build a door, ever after until you deconstruct that door, you will have a dirt floor underneath of it. Building a door does not automatically build a floor underneath of it. But it's all right. We can come back in and build a floor here later as we have more materials. So we'll let them get on that. <laughs> I'll quit yakking so much. Here they come. Grabbing logs. Getting on that floor. See if we can see another tree come down. Once we do, we know we can build some more floor. Let's see. Let's try. Floor. Yeah, we had plenty of wood. Now there's no floor here because there's no wall there. That's our entrance. So then they'll build all of that. Now say we want to build another story. Okay, so we come back, same thing. We do walls. One here. One here. One here. Oh, that wasn't the corner, was it? This tree's in the way. We got to wait for it to come down. So we'll go over here, take out, oh, nope, what is it? It's under constructions, no, nope, it's under dig orders, it's, nope, yeah, it is. Uh, designate construction, there we go, alrighty. So we'll wait for him to take that tree out before we designate that corner, because the tree's in the way, but we'll go back to constructions, build a wall, we can get this corner, alrighty, and we can get this corner. Cool. Uh, same thing. Then we can come back and we can build, let's see, stairs. Oops. I must have clicked the wrong thing. Constructions. Bridge. Yeah, I didn't want to do a bridge. Same thing. Up a level. Click. And say, let's cancel that. Say we want to build this into a tower on the top of this. 
So we'll go into Constructions, Stairs, click here, and we'll zoom up one, two, three, four, five Z levels. Alrighty. We can do another wall right there. Oh, I can't get to that because I haven't done the floor yet. Now we could potentially, off of this, just build a floor. And they'll come up and probably build that. And it'll give you a little platform. This construction was canceled, so we'll click on it. Construction suspended, so we'll resume construction. And they'll get right on it. Because they couldn't reach it, they'll cancel it. So if you start designating things on the second story before they can reach it, they, they'll cancel the designation, and then it'll sit there. They won't uncancel it themselves. You'll have to go to that designation point, click on it, and unsuspend the, the construction. we got to build the, wall, the floor there. Excuse me. And then to finish it off, we're going to need a floor hatch, which we also don't have. Um, which is under doors and hatches and hatches and you'd put that on top of your stairs and it'll give you a door So now we have a completely enclosed space except for the door So we'll build a door and the hatch Alrighty See The door is done And of course the more experienced your worker is the quicker they're gonna be able to put these things together like construct uh, doors and hatches and <sighs> build them in the workshop yep so we can put a hatch actually right there and a door right here if we want to lock it we go to here and it won't let anybody through but we want to let people through to build that hatch they're already on it same with the hatch we can lock that hatch we will build a chair table and a bed oops it's at the top because you always need beds alrighty we got those trees down construction floor alrighty they're coming to build it See if we've got that chair yet. Yep. They're on it. And we can do that table. And then make it an office, assign a dwarf, our expedition leader is our manager, ask, alrighty, and then if we go down to our nobles, we have our requirements met, and a nice little structure to boot. Oh, there's no floor there. Yep, let's finish that. I had a feeling. Oh, because we've locked the hatch, silly me. Unlock that hatch. <laughs> no kidding. Alrighty. And then there's some really tricky things here. So we've got this floor that we built off the stairs. We've got nothing under here for a bit we can actually start building another wall or floor out off of this. And then, say they go for that, we can build a wall off of that. And then this gets really interesting when you have all this edge building going, because you can do some silly, silly structures. So actually mining uh, up downstairs is slightly more complicated in my opinion than building a structure going up it 
it just makes sense that this floor tile you have to build. But when you mine um, up downstairs, you mine the tile below to mine a stair up. So if you want to mine just straight up, you have to mine an upstair and then a downstair on top of it to be able to get to the next upstair or mine an upstair and then an upstair downstair on top of it for how many ever Z levels. I think building a structure like this is, is a lot simpler, but yeah. Anyway, there you go. Cute little indoor structure makes a nice little office for your dwarves. Catch you later, everybody.